Hey guys, welcome back to Magic TV. My name's Craig, it's six o'clock. It's time for a Magic Live. Today, I'm gonna to be performing uh, a really old trick. I, I can't remember the name of it. It's it's by, I'm, I'm gonna put it up on the screen. I've had a mental blank. This is, I, I wanna say Lonely Traveler, but I think that's completely wrong. I'm gonna to have to check out uh, the uh, Richard Zellman Yak because in Richard Zellman Yak, there's an updated version of this. And this is the updated version from Richard Zellman Yak. So I'll check it out, I'll put it on the screen for you. Uh, but it's a really fun routine to throw into the middle of a sandwich trick uh, or a, a, an act with sandwich routines in it. Uh, Luke, you gonna help me with this, is that all right? Yeah. I'm gonna take out the four jacks for this. I'm gonna take out the jack of clubs, the jack of hearts, the jack of spades and the jack of diamonds. Take out the four jacks. And you're gonna to need to pick a card. Any card that you want to is fine. Uh, it doesn't matter whether I see it. It's not that sort of trick. The queen, you want the queen of diamonds? I do like okay, it, yeah. you like the queen of diamonds. Yeah. Um, I would normally get you to sign this card, yeah. but two reasons why I'm not going to. Number one, I don't know where there's a Sharpie marker. There's one around somewhere, but I'm not too sure where. And, and two, I've just opened this new deck of cards and they cost a fortune. They're the happy, sad deck. And I've got to review them on the show later. So I am not going to have these cards wrecked. So uh, with your permission, I'm going to, uh, I'm not going to, I'm not going to have it signed. Is that cool? Yeah. Um, so take the cards and cut them into two piles and put them there because you make all the decisions in this trick. This is really cool. Now we're going to put that queen in between one of the jack in between one of the pairs of jacks either the red jacks or the black jacks where do you want it black <coughs> you see you want it there like that yeah. and we're going to put this entire packet of jacks and cut it into either that half or that half <coughs> which half would you like to cut it into so you, there's your card yeah. the queen of diamonds and i'm going to take the jacks with the card in between them and cut them there down into the deck. Is that fair? Yeah. Now, you made all the decisions here, didn't you? Yeah. And this this half of the deck has been here the whole time. I'm going to put this half with the with the jacks in it and your queen over there. Now, this half over here, this is where things get interesting. Because we left the two red jacks out, didn't we? Mm -hmm. And this is the interesting thing about the two red jacks. I want you to watch. If I take those two red jacks and put them here... When I snap my fingers, that two red jacks have one card in between it, which is the Queen of Diamonds. The Queen of Diamonds has actually gone in between the two red jacks. It was over there, now it's over here, which is kind of weird. Do you want to know how it works? Yeah. It's an illusion. You see, if I snap my fingers, you can see that the illusion is broken. You can see there was nothing there in between the two red jacks. And the reason is, this packet here that's been here the entire time, there's two black jacks down in the middle of that packet with one card in between them and one card only. And that's <laughs> the Queen of Diamonds. <laughs> see, I told you. I told you. It's all an illusion. None of it was real. So there you go. It's a really cool trick. Let me know in the comments down below what you think. If you want to see more videos like this, like the video, subscribe to the channel, leave a comment down below, and I'll be back again tomorrow at 6 o'clock with another Magic Live. I'll see you then. <laughs>